Hello, my name is Enoch, and I make things. I've made a lot of things, but most of all, I love to make games. I started making games with Scratch when I was in grade three. My love of programming and visual design has really made video games the perfect medium for me. A while ago, I noticed the absence of Chinese Scratch materials on the internet. So I started creating YouTube tutorials about Scratch in Chinese. Hello. As of today, I have over a thousand subscribers and over a hundred thousand total views. I think creating is all about having fun. When you're having fun, learning becomes effortless. You can naturally learn how to solder things and the logic of circuits when you're trying to make your own cardboard arcade machine. And you can naturally learn to use trigonometry when you're trying to make a physically accurate airplane game. That is my core concept that goes into making all of these projects. I try to make sure that all of my games are interesting before I turn them into a tutorial. It's more about how you can get these viewers interested in creating. Once they are interested, you're igniting the spark of curiosity in them. The motivation is just passion. It's so much fun. So I want my book to be fun. It has to be interesting. It's just like the games I design. And I think that's also one of the major differences for my book and other books in the market, because a lot of books in Chinese, at least, are written by computer science teachers, and they are usually adults. And adults don't really focus that much on making something fun. I'm starting with a game. I'm starting with something appealing that they can connect to instantly. My goal is to provide information, material, resources, most importantly in Chinese because language is a barrier. And that's also the reason I have to do this in Chinese because there aren't that many people doing this in Chinese. So that's basically what I hope to communicate through my work. We can take a look at the book now. Let me walk you through my book. This book contains seven different tutorials for seven different games. And with each tutorial, there are text step-by-step -step instructions, and then also screenshots very clearly telling you what you need to do to write the code or to make the game. Aside from programming, I also included some tips on how you could draw stuff with Scratch and also some other resources like music and art for your games. This book is about game design and not just programming. So there is a lot more that goes into game design than just programming. And I have made sure to acknowledge that. There are also special segments to introduce programming fundamentals like variables and if statements and forever loops. When I was designing this book, I really wanted my audience to be broad. So there is a level system. In the first half of the book, it's level one and level two. It's more suitable for people who are just beginning to learn their scratch fundamentals. And in the other half of the book, with level three and level four, the content gets harder and more complex. And I think that's a main feature of my book is that I have included something in here for everyone. So I've also included some short comics. There is always going to be something in here for you. And I've put a lot of work into this book to make sure that there's something in here for everyone. And even if the only thing that you get out from this book is inspired to draw your own small comics, that would be a win in my book. There are also links to all of my online content, QR codes that lead to video tutorials and links that lead to the materials or the game itself. So yeah, I think that basically wraps it up for the book. I could show you this last comic I drew. Um, this is me writing the book and it wasn't all fun and games, I must tell you. You do get frustrated, you do get burnt out, but I mean, in the end, it's really, really cool. And I'm really grateful for anyone that might read my book. So I wrote, thank you. That's thank you in Chinese. I would like to end this video with a quote from Professor Mitchell Resnick. He is the director of Scratch at MIT Media Labs. And he says, as I see it, whoever's doing the inventing is also doing most of the learning and probably having the most fun. 
And I love this quote very much because it, it basically encapsulates everything I love about Scratch. It's Scratch is so creative and gives us so much freedom. And I've really benefited from that. And I've learned a lot. So I wish to help more people also learn and benefit from Scratch. And also not just Scratch, from creating. That is my goal and that's what I want to do. Thank you for watching my video. I will see you next time.